Hello everyone, Tech1421 here. Welcome back to another Pokemon Showdown live session. Today we are going to be doing some random battles. Now I'm going to put these battles out throughout the week like I normally do. And we'll see how many battles we get through. I'm expecting a lot of just randomness and we might see some forfeits here and there. But we're going to try to get through some pretty fun and exciting games and kind of see what we get. I like doing random battles every once in a while. It's just kind of fun to see what you get and to kind of just have some fun. <laughs> so that's what my plan is today. Our very first Pokemon of the session is a Seviper, or however you say it. We got ourselves a Mawile, which is a Mega Mawile, which has Fire Fang, which is interesting. A Hydreigon, a Heloisk, Specs Heloisk. A Azelf and a Gorsbis that thing. So I guess the best thing to do right off the bat is probably is glare paralyzes, right? Yes. So I'm gonna go ahead and get the glare off. We have Focus Sash on our Sleviper. So that's that's fun. And he's going to switch out into <laughs> into a Ferrothorn, so it's a good thing I didn't go for the the Toxic. And Actually, I don't have Toxic. I thought that was Toxic. It's Coil. So now I'm just going to Coil, because there's no reason for me not to just Coil up. And our Stab moves are... We have Sucker Punch, which isn't going to hit this thing very well. And I think we have Aqua Tail, which is not going to hit this thing very well either. But in all honesty, I don't think he can really do anything to us, unless, of course, he has that one grass move that you do more damage if you're slower than the other person, I forget what it's called. And he gets the Thunder Wave off on us. Which is a little unfortunate. I... think the best play now... Do we have a fire move besides... I don't want my... Okay, well I could go into Mawile and then set up a sub. I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go into Mawile, set up a sub. We get the Intimidate, which isn't going to do much. And then he gets the Leech Seed, which is annoying. I'm going to go back in the Surviper. <laughs> because Mawile is probably in the end going to be my win condition. And I don't want that thing to get paralyzed. And so he has. Protect, Thunder Wave. I didn't realize I had Shed Skin. So that was a misplay on my part switching out. But you, know, you don't see these things very often. Uh, he could possibly go for the Leech Seed again, which he's probably going to do. He's going to Thunder Wave again. Uh, hopefully the, the Shed Skin... Yep, there we go. Gets rid of that. Now, I don't think I can really do much damage to this thing at all. So I'm just going to continue to Coil Up. And hopefully... The uh, Leech Seed doesn't stack up over time too much if he does end up going for it. And he might just want to switch out. Uh, and I don't know his other four Pokemon, so... You know. I don't know what I'm looking looking for here. I'm, poison, I'm pure Poison type, so... I guess that's good. This, I mean, you know, this thing can't really hit me with anything. Um, he's fully paralyzed, which is nice, and I'm going to continue to coil until I see him go into another Pokemon. And I just hope he doesn't lead, get a Leech Seed off. And there's the Leech Seed, it does hit. And I'm going to go for another coil, predicting to protect. He does not protect. There's the T-Wave. And we get rid of it with the Shed Skin. And now I'm going to start going for some super effective Aqua Tails. Not that I'm not, they're not super effective. But this will hit because my accuracy is so high. And he does protect this turn. Which is unfortunate. And now I'm going to go for another Aqua Tail. 
And that doesn't even, that doesn't like do anything at all. Um, there is a T-Wave. And in the end, he's just gonna win this battle. So I'm gonna go into... It's just unfortunate I don't have anything really to take this. I'm going to go into Azelf and go for the Taunt. There's the Protect. He does have lefties, which is good to know. And I'm gonna go for the Taunt. Because he only has, he has Protect, Leech Seed, Thunder Wave, and Leech, uh, Leech Seed, Thunder Wave, Protect. T-Weave, did I say all of them? I don't know. Um, so there we go. So he's taunted, which is great, but I still can't really hit him with anything. I'm gonna go for the, th the Thunderbolt. Maybe I should just go for Psychic. I'm gonna go for a T-Bolt. And he's gonna go into Gengar. Okay, so he has a Gengar. Hopefully this is not Mega. And... I think... My best play is just to go back into Seviper at this point and just let him die. He's gonna go for Hypnosis. And now I can go for a Sucker Punch, hopefully it hits. He is a Mega Gengar. And I get fully paired. So that's gonna knock me out. Uh, I really wish that I didn't get fully paired there. Are any of these Scarf specs? I think Gorbis, unless, as long as he doesn't have Energy Ball, can take a hit. So I'm going to go for the Ice Beam. Which I'm not sure can kill or not. But it's worth a try. It's probably going to do around like maybe 30% or so. I don't know. Our special, I mean our special attack is decent but not great. And the tough thing is I have to stay in here. I'm going to start the timer. If he would have had energy ball, he would have used it already. So I'm thinking maybe he's just going to go for another shadow ball. Or maybe he's thinking about switching back out into Ferrothorn. We will find out. But the Ferrothorn is going to be a big problem. I'm going to have to switch in on something with my Mawile and then get the Mega Evolution up, and then try to go for the sub, so that um, his Ferrothorn can't hit me with anything. But, not knowing what his other three Pokemon are, could be a little bit of a problem to figure out exactly what to do. So he's gonna go for Hypnosis, which means I can't switch out anymore, which is really, really rough. He's gonna now Pain Split. I'm still asleep. I can't switch out either. This is why Mega Gengar was banned. Um, he's gonna go for a sub now. I really wish that Sucker Punch hit earlier. He's gonna go for Shadow Ball. That's a two hit KO. I finally wake up. I might get rid of the sub, but that's about it. And... At this point, he's just going to keep setting up. I'm going to hope that I wake up again. Um, I'm going to go for a sub, hoping to wake up. And yeah, well, okay. And I'm asleep anyways. The hacks, this game was terrible on my, uh, just for me. Uh, he might go for a sub now. He's just going to go kill me with a Shadow Ball. Uh, really, really rough this game so far. I have not got anything going in my favor. I'm gonna go into my while now. I really need to get something going. Um, I would usually have Sucker Punch on this thing. Instead, I have Fire Fang. I'm gonna go for a sub. 
And he's going to miss Hypnosis. Finally, something goes in my favor, which is great. Now I'm going to go for a Iron Head because that's going to be doing a lot of damage now that my stats have changed. And my attack is hitting for a good amount of damage that does break the sub, but I do knock out with Iron Head. So that's good news. His biggest threat by far is going to be knocked off the table right there. He's going to go with Ember, M M Embor. I'm going to go into Hydreigon, I guess, because if he has Will-O-Wisp, then I don't mind getting Will-O-Wisp. And if he has just a... Okay, he goes for Earthquake. Hopefully he's Choice Banded. Um, I have Leftovers. I am going to go for the Earth Power, which I would never put on Hydreigon, but hey... What can you do? So, hopefully this does a good amount of damage to him. This will be super effective if he does stay in. I think, at least. I could be wrong. Embor! And if he goes into... his Ferrothorn... I'm gonna have to go into my Azelf again so that I can taunt. Looks like he was choice into something. Uh, this is only 27%. Now I have to make a decision. Do I just Draco twice in a row and hopefully kill? I think Hydreigon still has... It's still good. Um, I do have Dry Skin on my Hilloisk as well, so I'm going to go into him. And if he goes for a Leech Seed, I can just Volt Switch out. So there's the T-Wave. I can't get T-Waved, of course. And now I'm just going to go for a Dark Pulse, I guess. Hopefully get some good damage off. I, the only thing that can kill this Ferrothorn is going to be my... Um, whatchamacallit, my Mawile. He is going to get fully paralyzed, which is great. It's a little bit of payback for earlier. And now I'm going to go for another Dark Pulse. I am Choice Specs. And that gets a crit, yay! Crits are crits! And that kind of makes up for the Gengar earlier, the miss, but... Not quite. So it only does 33%, I was just kind of testing the waters. He's going to go for the Toxic, I do have Shed Skin. And it doesn't look like I'm going to get rid of it there. He, I don't see an item on him. I might be able to 3-hit KO. So I'm just going to stay in here. I'm hoping that, you know, it does maybe more, a little more than 33% at least one of the other two times. So, uh, we will see. If it does, you know, 34% and then 33 the next time, that's going to be a KO. To a KO. He could easily have Earthquake here, but in these, you know, in these battles, you, you really never know for sure. He has Toxic, he might have something like Rocks. He might be have Rapid Spin. He might have X Scissor, Stone Edge. <laughs> so many different things. And he's going to disconnect. So I didn't get to find out his other two Pokemon. It would have been nice for him to finish that. I'm going to... Uh, yeah, he doesn't hasn't come back yet. I'm going to stop it here. If he does come back, which I really hope he does. Or she, he or she, if... If the, my opponent comes back, which I hope they do, then I'll continue. But if not, I will see everyone in the next episode. Hope you enjoyed the first part. Like always, if you can leave it a like, that'd be greatly appreciated. It helps the first part get off to a good start. If we get 10 likes in this first part, I will upload uh, two parts of the, of I'll upload two parts of this tomorrow. So go ahead and do that, and I will uh, see you next time. Peace.